Look at this. That's crazy, right? <laughs> Welcome back to Big Brist TV. And on this episode, I thought I'd do a quick update on my tank. This is a 55 gallon uh, all glass tank and I uh, removed the rim. I got it started, uh, I don't know, I wanna say 10 months ago. And uh, it's a straight up jungle now. Look at this. I've got unruly pothos growing out the side, just trailing. And that was a cutting from this one over here, which is doing the same thing. Ridiculous. Those are the bamboo that I originally put in there when I first started the tank. Look how tall they've grown, about two feet out the top of the tank. Man, here's another bamboo here. Two more there. That was really small. Baby, that I put it there. There's a peace lily back there. There's the neon pathos. There's a monstera there. And another monstera back there. Not doing so well. I moved it because I think uh, it was getting too much light, if that's possible. But then look inside. I've got this moss. This is a piece of moss that came with some shrimp that I bought. And it's taking off. Look at it down here. There's a piece of uh, a cardinal plant that had broken off and I let it float. And look, that wide stem, that wishbone there, is the roots and let it look. It's bent and turned upward. I took out all but one small strand of the Brazilian pennywort and look at it now. It, it just bounces back. It just keeps coming back. I could take all of it out of the tank and it just grows. Look at the root system of that pathos. There's an Asian water fern right there, still doing well. It's branched off and made several babies. As you can see here, that's a leaf that has turned into babies. Sorry for the glare. That's S. Repens. Look how she's uh, so tall now, growing up toward the light. Small piece of uh, Luigia there. Another cardinal. We got all of that uh, dwarf Sagittaria, which looks like grass, all in the bottom of the tank. I wish I knew how to do this without the glare, but there's the remnant of my Asian water fern in the back over there. It used to be down here, which you can still see some leaves, but it's broken off and made some babies. And back in there is just all the roots. Still got my original 13 neon tetras in there. These guys are doing well. But hey, let me just step back. Look at this. That's crazy, right? <laughs> a little rainforest, jungly looking thing in the middle of my, my living room. But anyway, that was just a quick update. If you liked the video, hit it with a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, hit it with a thumbs up and subscribe. Uh, maybe I'll do a, an update once every month on the tank or whatever. I may have some more stuff going in here, but I don't know what more I could put in there. I'm thinking about doing some uh, some more ghost shrimp we'll have to see until the next time everybody stay well and i'm out